Ratcliffe. Headed on, and Redmond once more denies Everton. Quinn's giving it away, though. McDonald coming forward. Nevin. Chipped in towards Sheedy. Reed gets it clear. Now Hinchcliffe. Begree. A dangerous looking ball, and Coton read it well. That was good goalkeeping by Tony Coton. Quinn. Reed looking for White on the right. Point and finding the player manager. Oh, vintage stuff from Peter Reed. Now Ward. Brightwell. Quinn is the target. And Quinn met it well, and it breaks to Megson. How did Neville Southall manage to get himself behind that shot? It looked odds on Gary Megson scoring. Denied by his former teammate Neville Southall. Poynton, White, Ebrill for Everton. That's a lovely ball, but there was a suspicion of offside, not given though as Nevin goes on. Well saved, it comes to Beagree! And how about that? He got heart out, Hugo Sanchez. Peter Beagree scores his first ever goal for Everton and gives us a celebration to remember. But Manchester City will complain here that Beagree and arguably Nevin as well were in an offside position when the ball was played. Nevin going on and producing that excellent save from Coton and Bigri shot in off the foot of the post to give Everton the lead. Well, from up here, it certainly looked offside, I have to say, Pat Nevin on that, in that wide position. The goalkeeper caught very unfortunate there because he made the great block and then it fell kindly for Bigri and it's in off the post. And he finds Sharp, who finds Sheedy and it back to Sharp and no offside again with a good save. The Manchester City players turn angrily towards the linesman on the far side. They felt they might have had the benefit of an offside decision again then. And Sharp close to punishing them for a second time. But Coton with a good save. Ratcliffe with the kick. Eagree doing well to find Sharp. And McCall goes in hard again on Ward. This is Beagree. Cut out. By Hendry, back in from Beagree. Sheedy with a spectacular goal! What a beauty! A magnificent goal by Kevin Sheedy! That's as good as you'll see all season, I would think. An acrobatic effort. Well, there won't be many better goals this weekend than that one. That was a classic goal. As we know, he's got this sweet left foot of his, but what a lovely volley. And really, the goalkeeper, well as he's playing today, couldn't get anywhere near that one. Brilliant goal, and Bigri involved in the build-up. He did well, Bigri, actually, you know, a good deep header into the box. And there, what a finish. Brilliant goal, Everton second from the other side of the ground, and I bet it looks even better from here. Brazilian like that. Nevin on the right. Sharp and Sheedy forward. Sharp header! Knocked behind for a corner. Sharp near post, Watson behind him. Good header away by Redmond, it comes to Ebrill. That was good goalkeeping again by Tony Coton and John Ebrill, so unlucky. Maxson. Redmond forward. He's getting in behind the Everton defence. Southall saves it, right, hits the rebound, wide of target. And again, we've seen excellent goalkeeping. This time by Neville Southall. Ward, beaten, and Everton counter-attack with Sheedy. Poynton's tackle, it breaks to McCall. Threaded through towards Nevin, but it didn't reach its target. Ward now, McCall beats it down again and gets it back from Nevin, McCall! Excellent play by the Scottish international Stuart McCall. Cotty. 
pull back, intended for Sharp, but met again by Harper, who's now urging his defenders as McDonald crosses dangerously and over the head of Sharp. Sheedy. Ebrel. Sheedy again. Oh, a splendid effort! That was unlucky from Coddy. Very sharp in the penalty area then, the Everton substitute. And very close. See what it looks like from the other side of the stadium here as Sheedy pulled it back. Good first time crack. As Roger Milford blows the final whistle, confirmation that Everton have beaten Manchester City by two goals to nil.